Imagine getting paid just for sharing your thoughts on products and services you use every day. With Survey Junkie, it's that simple. Click on the link in the video description to discover how you can start earning today by taking surveys. Taylor Swift's concert in Edinburgh, Scotland, Saturday was briefly interrupted by an alleged lewd criminal. A 64-year-old man was arrested and charged in connection with a voyeurism offence committed within Mayfield, Scotland Police Superintendent David Haps said in a statement. Voyeurism is defined as the practice of gaining sexual pleasure from watching others when they are naked or engaged in sexual activity. No further details were provided about the incident. Haps concluded his statement by sharing that the unidentified male is no longer in custody, stating, he was released on an undertaking to appear at Edinburgh Sheriff Court at a later date. Our channel has reached out to Swift's reps for comment but did not immediately hear back. Saturday's show was one of three era's tour concerts that the pop superstar performed in Edinburgh. On Friday night, Swift's show had a much more pleasant interruption when a couple got engaged. Congratulations, wow, the love story singer, 34, said after pointing out she was able to see the proposal take place because of the sunlight over the stadium. I just saw that whole thing. Man, that's amazing. Thanks for doing that at my concert, that's a big moment. Leading up to Swift's arrival in Scotland, local officials took nearly every measure to ensure that the Grammy winner and her fans would have a comfortable stay, even forcing homeless people to relocate. Shelter Scotland, a charity that supports many in need of housing, claimed last month that several people had been moved via taxi to Glasgow, Aberdeen and Newcastle to free up temporary accommodations. Our frontline services are already seeing people in need of a bed tonight being told their only option is to leave of the city, the charity's director, Alison Watson, said at the time. By clicking above you agree to the terms of use and privacy policy. A family going through the trauma of homelessness in Edinburgh should not have to move miles from their job, school, and community to find emergency accommodation. The Edinburgh City Council denied at the time moving homeless people who had already been set up, but housing convener councillor Jane Maher recognized, were aware of the situation and are working with the affected households to find appropriate, alternative accommodation. Now that Swift has wrapped her shows in Scotland, she is headed to Liverpool, England for the next stops in the international leg of her era's tour.